Tonight is the last night people can smoke inside businesses and indoor public spaces in Dayton, Kentucky. The citywide smoke-free ordinance goes into effect tomorrow. As Local 12's Jenna Cisneros reports, some business owners say the ordinance is not fair and feel they're being targeted. Only a handful of businesses in the city of Dayton offer smoking inside. Rose Room is one of them, but the days of smoking one of these inside ends tomorrow and business owners fear they're going to lose customers. They already said they're, they're not coming in here. It's the fear Patricia Flynn, co-owner of Flynn's Rose Room, prays will not become a reality. Surely there's bigger fish to fry out there than me. You got your casinos that have thousands of people going in and out of there every day, every week. They allow smoking indoors. The Dayton City Council voted three to two for a ban on smoking inside all businesses, citing overwhelming health data in favor of going smoke free in the ordinance. Customers are already sounding off. I think this city sucks. They don't mind charging us seven dollars for a pack of cigarettes, getting the taxes from it. So why did who are they to tell us we can't smoke in a bar? The one exception listed in the ordinance are private clubs. It's just not fair. If it's about healthy air, then every one of them, I don't care if you're a private club or not, it should make no difference. Though Flynn says she feels targeted, she and her team say they will be enforcing the ordinance. Oh, I mean, we have to comply. I mean, well, we barely make enough money to pay the bills. We don't want to pay fines that they've inflicted. Come Sunday, she's not the only one worried. A few blocks away, you'll find Tony's Old Saloon, another bar that allows smoking indoors. Simple fact that people that regularly come here and regularly smoke are not going to come here because they can't smoke. We'll stay home and smoke. Manager and bartender Jennifer Saunders fears for days like Sunday, having to enforce the ordinance on a busy game day. I really don't know what to tell them. Um, we're, we're working on an outdoor area for, for the smokers to go to, but I don't know if they're going to want to do that or not. And I mean, I really don't blame them for not coming in because I wouldn't go to a bar I can't smoke at. Both Saunders and Flynn are asking for customers to continue supporting them and are asking for patience. We just have to adjust with the times and get used to people telling us what we can do. Dayton is the 33rd city in Kentucky to implement a smoke-free ordinance. Jenna Cisneros, Local 12 News. Now, smoking is banned in most public buildings and establishments across Kenton County, except for bars.